Welcome everybody, this is Master Marcel tapping in Video blog Excited to be here Today is Saturday April 24th, 2021 it's a Dialogue, it's a moment in time A very, very powerful moment in time to me Let me beat up, continue to Started right after the song, man. Uh-huh. Hey. Yeah. Everything that I say is entertainment. Don't take anything that I say is say serious. Welcome everybody, welcome from all across the world, wherever you're tuning in from. I'm excited to show you who the fuck I am, man. It's Master Marcel tapping in. Man, I'm in love with every aspect of my life. I'm loving every aspect. So we're going to tap in on that subject there. Because that's an end of the subject. Yes, it's still breathing. That's who I believe. This video blog is for adults and adults only. No kids, okay? Adults and adults only. I will be using explicit language and content and concepts. Tell the world, this is Master Myself. You need to come tap in. Come tap in with Master Myself. Come and see live from Phoenix, Arizona. A strong representative of the South Coast. We're gonna tap in very soon. It's the year 2021 if you're watching in the future. A year where we live out our philosophy, where we live out our truth. This is our contribution to the world outside of us. I'm excited to be here, man. Welcome, everybody. Officially, this is Master Myself once again tapping in from Phoenix, Arizona. It's a pleasure to be here in front of you. It's a pleasure to have the moment in time to speak from my perspective, from my experience in this life. I know that there's nobody else that can speak from my ex- perspective and my experience. Now, at this moment in time, like I said before, it's April 24th, 2021. Um, for anybody listening, remember that you are having your own personal internal experience. Your internal experience is what defines your experience. You are the one experiencing that, right? So I come to you now experiencing life from an alternative perspective. I, at one point in time, I had a certain vision for my life and I thought that that was the direction that I was going, right? However, it morphed and evolved into aligning with my purpose, right? My greater purpose that is uh, what I'm here to do, how I'm here to serve the world, right? So I'm excited to be here, man. I want to continue to deliver this product, you know, this this process of, of unlocking myself because this is another evolution of me. And every single day for the last... For sure, it's a guarantee for the last year. It's longer than that, uh, since really February, January of last year. And even before that, of course, you know, though I was investing in myself, but this has been a continuous process. This is an evolutionary process that I've been a part of when it comes to changing my life dynamic of how I relate to life on the outside. Now, I'm coming to deeper and deeper levels of understanding what myself is, okay? How do I differentiate my mind from my spirit? How do I understand that I am the spirit being and I'm having this temporary existence and I'm here living as a human consciousness along with other people who are also on the process of figuring out themselves. Now, the people that are aligned with me in my circle are the people that are the ones that are leading nations. They're leading other individuals in their own worlds and their own perspectives, right? So I'm here to 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 speak on everything that we've been integrating into our life. You see, I'm a part of IMC Nation. IMC Nation is integrated martial arts concepts, and it's a nation. We are we are literally all across the world. I mean, 
it's, it's really global, you know. Um, I can go to New Zealand right now, and I know for sure I have a place to stay. I can go to Dubai right now, and I know for sure I have a place to stay. I can go to uh, anywhere in the States, and, and I know for sure I have a place to stay. You know, there's so many different connections that we have just being a part of this nation. And over this... And I got to go soon, so I got I to gotta wrap up my thoughts very quickly, right? Um, before I transition into the next part. I'm, in the, I'm coming to you live from the middle of my Beast Camp. Um, but this is, uh, you know, the Beast Camp is, is a spiritual experience, a spiritual uh, event that happens once a month when you're a part of IMC Nation and you're tapped in with the man known as AZD. And that's my mentor, right? So with me learning from him, with me understanding the dynamic of how I'm relating to the world in perspective to my own consciousness then I'm beginning to separate the understanding of what I thought I knew to what I'm just now experiencing right it's just a different lifestyle you know I speak things into existence and I've done it my whole life I've seen that process I've mastered that part of myself I, I like to say so I've seen that evolution in myself but what I'm experiencing now is an evolution in other people as a result of my words as well, right? I see the effect that I have on other people when I'm just speaking life into them or I can take that away from them as well. You know, this is all a point of perspective. This is all our own conscious relation with our outside experience. But the more that we become aware of our personal experience, the more that we know that we have to contribute to the world. You see, I'm beginning to recognize the value that I hold. For so long, I didn't know that, you know, me growing up in, in uh, religious philosophy, you know, being associated with Christianity, understanding everything that that stands for, and knowing the power of that, understanding that, having that as a strong foundation for me to speak on, and then having a platform, and the understanding that allows a certain, um, frequency and vibration for, for me to tap into, right? I know how to get into a very powerful state of mind that involves uh, speaking of tongues, that involves um, the expression and the thanks and the gratitude and the appreciation that you do when you tap into the frequency, it's a frequency, which is, it, which is God, which is Jesus, which is Christ. You know, Christ consciousness is that, it's, it's a frequency when you can tune yourself there because we are pe people and we are capable of tuning ourselves to different frequencies, right? So what I'm able to do now is blend the, the foundation of philosophy that I had growing up as a part of me, right? It's a part of, it's ingrained in, in me, that religious philosophy, but also a martial arts philosophy for me to approach life with. I've always had this, but I never understood the beauty and the value in it. And in me walking out my path you know, in me figuring out why I'm doing this. Why do I want to be uh, around these people? Why do I want to tap in with my mentor, the man that I, I look up to, right? I mean, you know, I, I look up to my dad up, up most because he's my number one role model and, and, you know, perspective that I've always had as a male figure, right? But in addition to that, I can say that there's another man that I respect as much, you know, or or, you know, yeah, as much or more, you know, than, than my perspective with my dad, because the level of knowledge that I'm able to acquire in the process of me becoming who I'm becoming, there's no limit, right? And it, it's not like one is better than the other. It's not like any dynamic that I look at. I mean, when I look at my mom, my relationship with my mom in relationship to, to my sisters, right? Or in relationship to my cousins or relationship to uh, the women that I have in my life, right? I have these different perspectives I can all weigh in on and say, oh, they are going to feel this way about what it is and I'm communicating. Well, regardless, it doesn't matter because I'm communicating from my perspective. Now, it's their duty. It's your duty. It's my duty to communicate from my own perspective and you communicate from your perspective. Okay? So, this is an introduction to me, Master Myself on a different level. You know, I'm gonna go deeper on these videos than I do on my Instagram videos. And normally what I'm going to start my videos off with, because I am at my core, a Stoic philosopher. I am a warrior monk. I really, really, truly 
will go to battle for those who I love and I, I appreciate and protect and provide and want a firm foundation of security around everybody who's associated with me. And that's what they have. Whether they realize it or not, it starts with the energy and the presence and the ability to communicate and, and direct and help people and serve people. At the end of the day, that's what my life is all about. I know that I'm here to live a life of service and that's my claim to my universe. I'm doing these video blogs in service to the world, okay? This is Master Myself tapping in. Just a firm introduction into who I am, what I'm bringing. I know I've talked about a lot of different to uh, topics and subjects. However, um, all of those are going to be combined and we're going to come up with our process. It's not the product that I'm focused on. It's the process that we're going to develop for you. Okay, coming up, coming soon. Um, right now, what's available right now, I have my Instagram first and foremost. So you can find me at Master Myself, M A S T E R M Y C E L L F. That's Instagram. Okay, you can find me there. And then on top of that, I will also have the. Okay, cool. We got some. I got some good news. So I have some more time. I can go longer on this. Perfect. So you can find me there. Um, I have there available is a my book. Right, my first volume of my book is called Self Talk. Okay, and what it is is just a list of affirmations, pretty much affirmations that I've used over time that have literally put me in a position that I'm in my life. Right, I create my reality by the words that I speak into existence. Right now, the more clarity that I achieve in this life, the more that I have to clean up those lines, those communication lines. So, there's a lot of evolution to come from those. But this is the first volume of that, and it's very, very powerful in itself. I mean, if you are able to just take on one of the affirmations as a perspective, it will help to evolve your perspective. Okay, um, so on top of that. Um, so I have the self-talk, right? The self-talk, that's my book in my, in my bio. Um, but also there is my uh, the self-call podcast, okay? Now, the volumes or, or the episodes that have been there so far are very, very powerful in themselves because uh, in those, you see me create um, a reflection, right, of myself by understanding the other person on the other side, just by asking certain questions and 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 I love to take on other perspectives and to see, okay, if I was in that position, because that's the only perspective that I can really take on, right? That's the only thing I can really truly, truly have. That's the only thing I do have. But that is because that's the only thing that I have. That's the only thing that I use, right? That I can use in order to better myself, in order to uh, help serve better, right? I have to use my perspective to add to somebody. I'm not taking away from somebody unless that thing that I'm taking away is a negative thing. But that's the power of being a, a warrior monk. As a part of IMC Nation, we clean out our own systems, our own machines, our own perspectives. We do the work on ourselves so that we can serve other people. Now, this has been a value that I've been aligned with my whole life, <laughs> all the way from, from the moment I can remember, okay, we're going to church. Well, why are we going to church? Because we're going to serve. We're going to go serve God, right? We're going to go serve the, the you know, community. We're going to go serve. That was always the message, serve. It's always been my message. It's always, always been my message, right? At the core of anything that I talk about is service. How are we going to serve? So being... A part of IMC Nation, you know, we, we are fine-tuning the process of serving ourselves so we can serve the world better. And when I serve the world better, how am I communicating with the world? Well, I'm accepting whatever's happening in my universe, whatever is happening outside of me. I can say that it's actually what I always know, what I internally know, is that my internal experience, right? That's my experience, and my internal experience is my value that I can contribute to the world. When I speak on my experience, this is something that I'm learning and adjusting to myself, right? It's a, it's a forever um, evolution of self, right? But in the process of you mastering yourself, for example, what does that mean to master yourself? Well, to, to go as deep as you can, 
with yourself and say, you know what, no matter what, I'm going to find a way to get better today than I was yesterday. Because today is a brand new day. I have no attachment to what I, what I experienced yesterday. But today is a brand new day. How am I going to experience life? Deciding on how I experience life. That's where the clarity will come from. When you choose to move forward in your life, that's there's nothing like that. There's nothing like just moving forward in life and, and going towards your goals and your dreams and your desires. And that's what I'm doing here on these video blogs. Okay, I'm going to just go. I'm going for it. <laughs> I'm not going to hold back. I'm just going to go ahead and go in. Because I'm realizing right now, this is the only thing that has been my evolution is my communication. That's my evolution. And it's of service to the world. Because when I speak, people always give me some kind of feedback. Good, bad, and different, it don't matter. It's feedback. It's, it's data that comes back to me. I received that. And I'm saying, okay, cool. Now I understand this is what other people appreciate, right? This is what people are picking up on. This is what people are not hearing. This is what people are seeing from their perspective. But I'm going to do this in, in true expression of just being me. How I know how to be me. I mean, I just know how to be me. <laughs> I know how to I know how to do this. I know how to be. I know how to just let go and and relax and, and be calm in the moment and appreciate whatever happens. And I believe that's my value. That's my contribution to this world. And so I'm just gonna continue to do that. And I'm excited about it, man, because I didn't think that it was gonna go to that level to that extent at all. Um, me starting this video blog, you know, that was not my approach, but my approach is founded in different philosophies, but the number one one that I was thinking about as soon as I started to talk about it was Amor Fati. Amor Fati, which means I love my fate. I love my life. I love the way this is working out. I love my perspective. I love being me because there's nobody like me. There's nobody like you. I only say that so that you have that own, you have your own perspective to take on right I love being me I, I truly 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 love being me people don't understand I, I really really truly love being me I love hearing my my voice and my my videos I, I, I told somebody the other day I was like man I love just just looking at my own you know my uh profile I'm like man I'm my, I'm my biggest fan truly I look at my stuff every day I'm like, man, that's a, that's just dope. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it don't matter what it is that's that's in front of me. That's how I feel, and that's just my honest truth. That's just what I know to be my truth at, at this moment in time, and it's evolving, you know. And I, I'm so fascinated with how this is going to continue to evolve because I see I see the clarity that comes with being me, you know. When, when I'm just being me, when I'm not trying to do anything else and I'm just express, expressing life or just understanding, oh, this is my perspective at this moment in time. Okay, cool. I know it's going to evolve tomorrow. I know it's going to become better tomorrow. That's what I do know. And it's a daily evolution. I mean, anytime I put myself out there, anytime I do anything that's pushing myself out of my boundary, I'm having a new experience. And that new experience is going to transform me. It's going to help me because I'm deciding that that's the way this is going to go. So have the perspective. If I have anything to tell you as a message in the last minute of this video is have the perspective of serving outside of you by first learning to serve yourself. Uh, that is a stoic quote. Um, it is a man who conquers himself conquers the world. It's something of that sort. I'm gonna get, I'll get back to you on that uh, stoic quote in particular. So it's gonna take too long for me to do all that right now. Um, but moving forward, I will have a stoic quote to pair these videos with um, as many as I can, and then we'll, you know, when I don't have any, we'll go through my own because I have a, a book that I call the Book of Self um, that we'll tap into. All right, so. Once again, man, it's a pleasure having y'all here. This is Master Myself tapping in from IMC Nation and the self-code. Be the best, fuck the rest.
<laughs> my salute and my be the best and fuck the rest at the same time. It's master myself tapping in. Salute.